Hey everybody, it's Bob the Bug Guy. Today we're going to talk a little bit about everybody's favorite friend, the yellow jacket wasp. Sometimes confused with the bee because of its coloring, the wasp is quite a different creature altogether. It has a hollow stinger which can inject venom into its victim should the wasp be disturbed, the home threatened. And unlike the bee, it can sting more than once, so you better be careful. Now most people think that the yellow jacket wasp is just a pest that ruins picnics, but they actually do quite a bit of good. They wipe out countless flies and caterpillars throughout the early spring and summer. By the fall, they switch their appetite to uh, rotting fruits, juices, things like that. Their home is made of a paper-like substance they get by chewing up wood pulp. The queen is the only one who survives the winter. She leaves the nest in the late fall, finds a rotting stump or something to winter over. In the spring she emerges, finds a spot for a new nest, and starts to build. For the most part, wasps will leave you alone as long as you're not threatening their home or squatting at them. However, sometimes they make their homes in the wrong spot. This becomes a problem and they need to be removed. Uh, using a spray is the easiest. Just after dark, when all the wasps are in their nest, you can spray the home and it effectively wipes them out. So that is the yellow jacket wasp. Hope you learned a little bit today. Stay tuned for more Bob the Bug Guy. Please make a comment. I'll do my best to respond. Thanks. Thanks for watching. Please leave a comment, click like, share my video, and subscribe to my channel so you will be notified when more great videos are posted.